John Stuart Curry was an American painter born in 1897 in Kansas. He became well known for his depictions of rural life in Kansas. His career spanned from 1924 until his death. Curry was a prominent figure in the American regionalism movement of the first half of the 20th century. Alongside Thomas Hart Benton and Grant Wood, he was hailed as one of the great painters of this movement. His paintings often portrayed farm life, animals, tornadoes, prairie fires, and the turbulent bleeding Kansas period. However, his works were not well received by Kansans, who felt that they did not present a positive image of the state. Curry's artistic production was diverse, encompassing paintings, book illustrations, prints, and posters. He was commissioned to create murals for the Kansas State Capitol, but the reaction to his most famous work, Tragic Prelude, was so negative that the Kansas legislature passed a measure preventing his works from being displayed in the Capitol. As a result, Curry did not sign the murals, and they were not hung during his lifetime. He eventually left Topeka in disappointment. Despite the controversy, Curry's works were characterized by energetic brushwork and dynamic forms, conveying movement and evoking strong emotions. His style was influenced by his fellow regionalists who also depicted action and movement. John Stuart Curry, born on November 14, 1897, in Dunavant, Kansas, grew up on a farm and was the eldest of five children. Despite his rural upbringing, Curry's parents were well-educated and had a passion for art. Curry's childhood home was filled with reproductions of famous artists like Peter Paul Rubens and Gustave Dore, which greatly influenced his own artistic style. Curry's artistic journey began when he received his first art lesson at the age of 12. He attended the Kansas City Art Institute and later transferred to the Art Institute of Chicago. After graduating, he worked as an illustrator for various magazines. In 1926, he traveled to Paris to study the works of renowned artists such as Gustave Courbet and Honoré Daumier. Upon returning to the United States, he settled in New York City and later moved to an artist's colony in Westport, Connecticut. Throughout his career, Curry's art focused on capturing the essence of American life and landscapes. In 1936, Curry was appointed as the first artist-in-residence at the College of Agriculture of the University of Wisconsin. During this time, he traveled across the state, promoting art in farming communities and providing personal instruction to students. This experience turned Curry into a conservationist, deeply concerned about the ecological disasters caused by man-made activities. He was commissioned to paint murals for government buildings in Washington and became a member of the National Academy of Design. In conclusion, John Stuart Curry was a significant figure in American art, particularly in the American regionalism movement. His paintings captured the essence of rural life in Kansas and showcased dynamic forms and energetic brushwork. Despite facing controversy and criticism in his home state, Curry's artistic production was diverse, including paintings, book illustrations, prints, and posters. His works evoked strong emotions and conveyed movement, influenced by his fellow regionalists. Curry's upbringing on a farm and exposure to famous artists during his childhood greatly influenced his artistic style. Throughout his career, he focused on depicting American life and landscapes. His passion for art extended beyond his own creations, as he became an advocate for art in farming communities and a conservationist concerned about ecological disasters. Curry's contributions to the art world and his impact on American regionalism make him a significant and influential painter.